Hi, I'm Shelby Fredericks. Uh, I grew up playing lacrosse on Long Island. I went to Northwestern University and uh, I'll be playing in the WPLL uh, for this upcoming season. When I started, I was probably in like third or fourth grade, um, but I have an older brother. He's two years older than me, Zach, and he, I mean, I was basically his shadow growing up, so we played every single sport imaginable um, in the front yard, and I'm so thankful uh, for those early years with him um, beating up on me so that I could have the opportunity to, to kind of carry that toughness over in, at the next level. So I went to Babylon High School on Long Island. It had been my dream to go to Northwestern from when I went to my first um, Northwestern camp when I was in like fourth or fifth grade. Um, so when I came in, I was a bit banged up, but I still found a role having really good hands, having good stick work kind of gave me that in when maybe my body wasn't really telling me to go on the field at all. I would say my playing style is just super um, loose. I like to have a lot of fun out there. Um, I like to you know, do different things with my stick and um, I really like to play with my teammates and kind of work off each other and I think that that's the most fun part of the game. So now I'm going to school at Northwestern. I'm in a grad program there um, in the Masters of Sports Administration. And then I'm also student coaching there, so every day I get to you know, be with the team. I get to learn from the absolute best, as well as be surrounded by um, you know, the amazing girls, the new, new freshmen that are in, and also the teammates that I had last year. I mean, I think the WPLL is so important for not only women's lacrosse, but just females in sport, when you enter college knowing that there's a future, knowing that there's, you know, even when you're you know, done with your senior year, I never thought that I would really play lacrosse competitively again. So it sparks something within you to keep on, you know, getting better, which I think, um, you know, the higher, the higher level we can go, the more it's going to grow and the more it's going to spread down to those younger generations and the more it's going to inspire and ultimately just connect us all through the sport. So. I'll be the first one to tell you that I am very stubborn with my stick <laughs> and even when the rule change happened I saw people switching to mesh and I was the first person to be like, no, <laughs> like I'm not ever using mesh, I don't need it, I'm happy. Um, so I was, you know, not really having an open mind and then I will never forget I was shooting um, at, summer, at summer camp this summer and Kara gave me her stick and was just like, just take a shot and I was like, I like my stick. I don't want to take. I don't want to take a shot with someone else's. And I took a shot, and I just remember. I just remember her looking at me after, and me being like, "Shoot! <laughs> like I really like this."